Since it's the Olympics, it's due time that I tell you about the most sudden and shocking death that took place during the Winter Olympics in 2010. Trigger warning, Nodar was only 21 years old when he qualified for his Olympic debut in the Luge men's single event. He was ranked 38 in the world. Sadly, he met a tragic end before he could compete for gold. On the day of the opening ceremonies, Nadar was trying to squeeze in as much practice as he could. On his 26th training run, he lost control in the very last turn and was thrown from his luge over the sidewall of the track where he violently impacted a steel pole. His luge was clocked at going 89.2 miles per hour just before the fatal accident. His autopsy revealed several severe points of blunt force trauma to his head and abdomen. His body impacted two points before hitting the pole, but the pole is where his injuries became immediately fatal. The track and sled were both analyzed by experts, but the coroner concluded that his death was a result of high-speed technical challenges and exacting physical force, meaning it simply fell into the assumed risk of competing in such a sport.